Well hey folks, BC7 here, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Farm Expert 17. Is it just me or when you click the big button that says continue the free ride, are you feeling kind of a mooch? <laughs> I don't know, must be just the way I'm raised, nobody gets a free ride. Alright, so last time around, we were uh, between us and the airplanes getting things done. We put some uh, crop in the ground. Uh, cannolis to be exactitude. So we got a couple of fields of canola, we've got a field of something that came with the farm, and uh, hmm, apparently there's a subsoiler you can buy, and it uh, plows and cultivates, and one of the other differences is that it doesn't leave the uh, dinosaur footprints at the end of your field. <laughs> they are a little bit much, aren't they? Wow. I'm pretty sure I never came that far off the field with a plow, to be honest with you. Oh, wait a minute, I had the hired workers do it. Oh. Well, I would appreciate it if they'd actually lift the plow when they got to the end of the field. So at any rate, we also uh, went to the animal farm. Yes, indeed, we have one of those, an animal farm. And we bought us some cows. Some cows. We have... 10 cows, one year old or younger. Yes, indeed. And we have 10,060 kilograms and 460 kilo of chaff. However, I don't believe we can actually buy chaff. So, because we go to the agro shopping and go to different, we can see we can buy the critters, we can buy hay, feed for poultry, and then the rest of it is all this sort of thing. Hmm. Yes. And, well, chaff is neither a seed nor a seedling, so I can't see it being there. So we'll have to hope they can get by on hay, I guess. Because <laughs> we need to advance until we see some... Uh, some sign of sproutisms here um, popping out from the ground and then we'll hit our fields with fungicide the two that require it and uh, well once that's done I suppose we can advance pretty much to harvest so um, I plan to continue playing this and I plan to keep bringing it to you guys but just as a sort of a Wow, they're terrible, man. Um, just sort of a caveat. I don't know how much longer Solden is going to carry on fixing this game. I was looking this morning on the Steam forums, you know, and there's, uh, I believe, 26 pages of bug reports. And they've already released four or five patches. And some of the stuff from the initial ones haven't been covered yet. So that's kind of, uh, well not exactly heartening for what may come um hopefully they'll you know get things to a point where it's uh really really super viable fun hoo hoo game and uh rather than just being kind of cool because it's different i'm gonna catch me one of these magpies one of these days <laughs> anyway let's uh let's advance time a little bit more and wait till we see some signs of life here shall we Let's go into our map. Let's go to mechanics, because you need to hire a mechanic to do this. You're really not capable of doing time by yourself. Let's pop to the 30th of April. And on the 30th of April, we see what? 750 euros we made from our cows. Uh, still nothing but these weird squares. da de -de -de. Sometimes you need to like walk out into the field and spin around and click your heels together. Um, <laughs> no, I don't know. Yeah. Doesn't really give an indicator, does it? Not in particular. Alright. Let's just wait a little into the day then, shall we? I've got the time set for however many X speed. It's not set at straight one to one anymore, so. The day should progress a little bit, at least to a point where hopefully we'll get, uh... Oh, wow, those are long shadows from those telephone poles. Check that out. <laughs> Holy cow. 
That's pretty crazy, man. The sun would be have to just about be on the horizon to get a, a shadow that long. 606, 607. Oh, I think we're going to need to speed this up just a little bit more than that. Let's go 24x. Just to see if this particular day will get us through. Oh, it doesn't really feel much faster, does it? Let's uh, wait till the next day, man. Whee! And the clouds roll in. You can't move that way. Uh, the bank requires a thousand plus five percent, so. And we made 50 euros. <laughs> well, there you go. 5% <laughs> came straight out of our cows. Alrighty. Let's see what it says in here, shall we? On our map, let's uh, zoom in. All right. Yeah, it, it, it's strange. It didn't seem to work properly before, but what it is is you've actually got to have it far enough over. Like if you try and zoom in while it's still at the edge of the map, it doesn't seem to work. It's almost like it needs to have room to zoom in a bit. Okay, so... 100%, 100%, still no signs of fungus. Uh, soil acidification is appropriate. Uh, okay, this is in the same boat. And this one's already had everything done, so we're sort of appropriate. Um, yeah, that's not really the way it works. It works on a scale, you know? Hmm. All right, let's jump back out of there. Yeah, I don't see anything coming up yet. Let's uh, oh, let's check and make sure our feed isn't going down too cuckoo. Uh, what do we got? We still get 95. We've got zero on this though. Yeah, I hardly think they're uh, <laughs> gonna die of old age. <laughs> hey, we got a little bit of fertilizer stored. That's kind of cool. I wonder if we can sell it here. I doubt it, eh? Alright. Oops, I actually should have just left that open. And let's go to... I'm going to slow that back down to there. Let's jump to... The middle of the month. 750 euro. And how is the cow situation? Uh, still 9,000 hay. Alright, I guess they'll probably produce a little less or some darn thing. I don't know how it works, to be honest with you. But we do make a little bit of money off it. We're sitting here at 26k. Hmm. Alright, let's go to the end of the month. Another 750 euro. And they're now sitting at... 8,500. Well, that's not bad. So what, about a thousand a month for the 10 cows then? I think I can live with that. And let us make it... Ooh, first a yoon. Now, I would think by now you would have something. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. Take that. Whoa! <laughs> Alright, see, that's kind of an issue. Alright. Let's go back to 1x. 1x, thank you. And, um, okay. Let's, uh, All right, now we want to fungicide this guy. See, there's still zero fungal growth, which is really weird because it should have been the time it started, to be honest with you, but there you go. So let's get that one done. And let's get... Hmm. 
Okay, this one's had everything done. So let's get that one done. There we go. Oh, now well, let's get the heck out of. Oh, right. We can't jump. I'm too fat to fly. Alright, let's just stay back from it. Here he comes. There we are. Nice. Hopefully he's already done the other field. Okay. There we go. That's looking good, too. Woo! You're not in the field. I know. Boy, that's some pretty thick something, isn't it? Alright, that's 100% done. Oh, no. Did I actually do one of the wrong fields? Oops. I might have dung double funginated that one field, man. Don't want to be caught double, double funginating. Nope. They're all done. Awesome. Alrighty. Hee hee hee. Okay. Let's go back here. Now you can pretty much spreadsheet this entire game if you want to, I think. It's the way it works, so, you know. Uh, let's have a look at our maminals. Still got lots. Excellent. So let's go to mechanics, and let's go to... Let me think here. Um, oh, I don't want to uh, mess up our crops. Somewhere I wrote down the actual approximated finish times. And I also wrote down 50 billion other things. <laughs> so it's not sticking out. Ah, here we go. Canola, approximately the 15th to 21st of July. So we should be able to skip through to the end of June without an effort. All right. And let's check our cows now. They are still doing good. Perfect. Perfect. Alright. So. That being said. How are these looking now? Uh, still tells me the same thing. If I go to this map. It tells me. Well, everything's doing just fine. All right. All right. So, let's go in here. It is now June. Let's wait. That'll give us July 1st. Happy Canada Day. Ooh. And the bank wants another thousand dollars. Yes, indeed. A thousand dollars. <laughs> That's great. Alright, now... Uh, let's go to... 10th. Alright. Let's see what it says. We are now... Cultivated fertilized protect protect insect da, 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 da. Okay, I don't think so yet. This one's gonna be exactly the same, but it's this other field. I'm not a hundred percent sure when this is supposed to come into its own. I know what that is. It's a grain silo. And though I look like I don't know what the grain silo is. Okay, wheat, but I don't know when it's uh, supposed to be ready, man. All right, we're gonna uh, jump from here to. The 15th. Alrighty. 200. There we go. That looks to me like it's ready to harvest. 100% is. And this part looks to me. See, we're still staying ahead of the game. Even though we've paid back several loan payments, you'll notice we're still up at the 2700 mark. 
this is not quite ready. All right. Okay, guys, next time around, we're going to uh, get that field harvested, and we'll pick up the grain from him. And then we're going to, when he's done, we'll advance a day and get started on these fields. So there you go. I um, hope you enjoyed the episode. Next time, we'll, uh, like I say, get some of our crop in, see what we can actually perhaps make use of for the cows, and uh, go from there. So hope you enjoyed. If you did, please hit the like button. helps me out a bunch. Remember, you can uh, share and favorite the video. That helps a bunch, too. Moves me up in the old search rankings so more people will watch. And uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, well, that little dude down there that's been pointing a gun at you the whole time, if you haven't got the hint yet, that's what he wants you to do. <laughs> All right, till next time, this has been BC7 for Farm Expert 17. Take care of each other, folks, and ciao for now. These lovely roses. Hmm. A little bit weird, but he's lovely. Do -do -do -do.